네. 사리나 씨의 이야기를 오늘 또 준비해 봤는데요. 우크라이나에서 우크라이나. 영어로는 유크레인. 유크레인. 한국어로는 우크라이나인데 음흠. 영어 한국어를 좀 섞어서 말을 하면 헷갈릴 때가 있어요. Right? 유크라이나라고 했는데 <웃음> 특히 나라 이름이 좀 그런 것 같아요. Yeah, I do that a lot too and I've only been in Korea for a short amount of time. So. That's right. Yeah. <웃음> 아무튼 유크레인 또는 우크라이나에서 지금 유학을 하고 있는 사리나 씨는 어떤 것을 후회하는지 또는 후회하는 일이 전혀 없는 건 아닌지 <웃음> 한번 이야기를 들어볼까요? Okay, Serena 씨, 나와주세요. Today I should be talking about things that I regret doing or not doing. But to be honest, and I'm really honest, I don't have any regrets at all. Um, I'm thankful to my mother that she told me to live my life in such a way that I can come home every day. Look into the mirror and tell myself, "Hey, today I'm proud of you. You tried your best, and there's nothing to regret." Um, I always try to improve myself, to take chances, to try new things, and on the other hand, just as well, is important to never harm anyone, to um, never put obstacles in someone's way, and if you try something and you failed. Then I just think it's not destined to be. It's okay. And if you have made a mistake, then well, you can learn from this mistake and improve yourself and uh, either try again or if it was if it was something bad, don't do it ever again. Okay. okay. Well, thank you for that advice, and I definitely agree with what she says. 음 맞아요. Yeah. 그 사리나 씨가 했던 말들이 뭐 교과서에 나올 것 같은 yeah. 굉장히 교훈적인 말들이었는데 uh-huh. 이런 말들도 그렇고 또는 어, 이런 말과 전혀 반대되는 스타일에서도 배울 게 많잖아요. Uh-huh. 굉장히 개인적인 솔직한 이야기를 하는 경우도 uh-huh. 있을 수 있는데 사리나 씨는 이번 비디오에서는 이번 영상에서는 어, 정말로 여러분이 그냥 암기해 놓으면 좋을 것 같은 명언들을 uh-huh. 많이. 어, 썼던 것 같아요. Mm-hmm. 자, 그럼 한줄한줄 한줄 공부해 보겠습니다. Okay, sounds good. So first, let's start with the first line, and that was today I should be talking about things that I regret doing or not doing. Today I should be talking about things that I regret doing or not doing. 네, 이 문장의 번역은 오늘은 한걸 후회하거나 안한걸 후회하는 것에 대해서 이야기해야 해요라는 말인데요. Mm-hmm. 먼저 처음부터 같이 공부해 보면. Today I should be 라고 하면 mm-hmm. 두 가지 의미가 있어요. I'm mm-hmm. supposed to be mm-hmm. 지금 뭐 해야 된다. 정말로 yeah. 의무가 있는 경우가 yeah. 있고 Today I actually should be in another studio. So 맞아요. let me just No, no, stay here. Oh, okay. Yeah, I can take care of that. <웃음> <웃음> 그런 경우 다른 데 가야 된다. 방금 전에 mm-hmm. 말씀하신 것처럼 또는 무언가를 해야 될 때. Today I should be ready for I should mm-hmm. be doing this. I should be working on my english 이런 mm-hmm. 형태로 해야 되는 일을 이야기할 수도 있겠고 또는 i should 라는 말 자체가 내 생각에 in my opinion mm-hmm. i had better mm-hmm. do this yeah 음. i should probably just let you take over and do everything by yourself really? since i'm an obstacle you know you're for not, you you're not so an obstacle let me just you know <웃음> You're trying to look for ways to leave the studio. <웃음> 네. yeah. Stay put, stay right there. 그런데 그래서 두 가지로 번역할 수 있습니다. 어, 진짜로 해야 되는 거 또는 mm-hmm. 해야, 해야 되지 않을까라고 생각하는 건데 여기서는 mm-hmm. 이제 저희가 주제를 드렸기 때문에 mm-hmm. 오늘은 이 이야기를 해야 되는데 라고 mm-hmm. 말을 이어가겠죠. Regret, 그 문장 뒷부분에 보면 은 Regret doing, regret 다음에 ing 형태 쓰는 거 mm-hmm. 여러분 이제 많이 접하셨죠? Mm-hmm. Regret doing or not doing. 해서 후회하는 거 또는 안 해서 후회하는 거 이야기를 하긴 해야 되는데 I can sense that there's a but coming. There's a but coming, yes. So like you said before, when you use that, I should be doing this, but I'm going to do something else. So let's see what her but was. Okay. Okay. (laughs) But to be honest, and I'm really honest, I don't have any regrets at all. (laughs) But to be honest, and I'm really honest, I don't have any regrets 네, 그래서 오늘은 이걸 이야기해야 되는데 라고 음. 앞에 운을 띄운 다음에 yeah. but 그런데 to be honest 솔직히 말하면 음. 근데 이 말을 또 이제 사람들이 안 믿을 수도 있으니까 mm-hmm. and I'm really honest yeah. 저 진짜 솔직하거든요 <웃음> 라고 말을 덧붙여서 설명을 하고 있죠 영어에서 이런 경우 많습니다 문장을 이어가다가 중간에 mm-hmm. 다른 말 약간의 mm-hmm. 전제로 까는 거죠 mm-hmm. sort of a premise right? Mm-hmm. 그런 다음에 I don't have any regrets at all 솔직히 말하면 전혀 후회되는 일이 없대요 
Wow, I'm jealous. <laughs> You're jealous? You have regrets? I mean, I think everybody has regrets. Really? Some, some regrets. 근데 여기서 지금 사리나 씨는 전혀 없다고 하니까 uh -huh. 그게 그런 부러운 거죠. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay, so let's see what she says in the next sentence relating to her mom. Okay. okay. I'm thankful to my mother that she told me to live my life in such a way that I'm thankful to my mother that she told me to live my life in such a way that 네. I'm thankful. 저는 감사하게 생각합니다. 누구에게? To my mother. 엄마에게. That. 이런 형태에도 알아두시면 좋겠죠. I'm thankful to you that. 뭐, 뭐, 뭐. Mm -hmm. 내가 나는 감사하게 생각한다. 그 뒤에 내용에 대해서. She told me. 엄마가 말을 해준 거죠. Mm -hmm. 어떻게 하라고? To live my life in, in such, such a way, way that. that. In such a way that. 도 여러분 외워두시고 mm -hmm. 많이 쓰셔야 됩니다. In mm -hmm. such a way that. Megan speaks in such a way that I want to listen to her. Yeah, and Hanu, Sam speaks in such a way that I don't think anyone really cares. <laughs> <laughs> 그렇군요. 저는 좋은 말을 했는데. In such a way that 하면 은그 뒤에 나오는 말이 mm -hmm. 결과로 일어나게끔 이렇게 한다. Mm -hmm. You should work in such a way that you, know, you get good results. With minimal effort. 맞아요. 네, 뭐 yeah. 최소한의 노력을 들여서 좋은 결과를 얻을 수 yeah. 있도록 일을 해야 된다. Mm -hmm. 그뭐뭐 하도록이라고 할때 가장 mm -hmm. 먼저 떠오르는 표현들이 in order to, mm -hmm. in order that 뭐 이런 yeah. 말들이 있지만. So you can. 음, 맞아요. 그런데 <웃음> 그런 말들을 안 쓰고 in such a way that mm -hmm. 이런 형태로도 많이 씁니다. Mm -hmm. 그러면 그 결과는 무엇일까요? I can come home every day, look into the mirror and tell myself. Mm. I can come home every day, look into the mirror and tell myself. 네. Very um, educational here. Yeah. 매일 밤, I can come home every day. 매일 밤 집에 와서. 물론 매일 밤이라는 말은 없지만 집에 오는 거니까. Yeah, of course, 매일, in the evening. 매일, whatever time. 네, 집에 와서 look into the mirror. Not at the mirror. Into, into the, mirror. the mirror. 거울 안을 들여다보는 거죠, 자신을. Mm -hmm. 거울을 보고 스스로에게 tell myself. 이렇게 말을 할수 있게끔 살라고 엄마가 말을 해준 것이 mm -hmm. thankful, 감사하다. Yeah. The sentence is not... Complete yet? Not fully complete. We have to find find out what she tells herself every day. That's right. And that is in the next sentence. Hey, today I'm proud of you. Mm -hmm. Hey, today I'm proud of you. Hey, 라는 것은 누구에게 말하는, 말하는 거죠? Herself. 그렇죠. 스스로에게 말하는 겁니다. Mm -hmm. Hey, today 오늘 I'm proud of you. 나는 네가 자랑스럽다. Mm -hmm. 그냥 스스로가 자랑스럽게끔. 어, 느낄 수 있게 살라는 mm -hmm. 말을 엄마가 해준 거죠. Mm -hmm. And there's another message. There is. You tried your best and there's nothing to regret. You tried your best and there's nothing to regret. 네. 오늘 이야기하는 거죠. 오늘 최선을 다했고 mm -hmm. and there's nothing to regret. Mm -hmm. 후회할 것이 하나도 없어. 이것을 매일매일 집에 와서 거울을 보고 mm -hmm. 생각하게끔 엄마가 이야기를 해줬다는 라 것이 mm -hmm. 고맙다는 라 말이죠. Mm -hmm. This is really hard, actually. It know. is really really difficult. 맞아요. Because especially I feel like most of the time we only focus on the things we did wrong. Mm. And we're like, "Oh, you know, this was so wrong or this was so bad." Mm. But we can't think about what did we learn from it or mm. at least we tried our best. 그렇죠. 그래서 어, 하루 최선을 다 했고 mm -hmm. 이제 좀 후회 없는 하루를 보냈다라고 매일 이야기를 할수 있게끔 살아라. Mm -hmm. 좀 넘어가 보겠습니다. Mm -hmm. I always try to improve myself to take chances to try new things. I always try to improve myself to take chances to try new things. 저는 항상 try 노력합니다. to mm -hmm. 무엇을 하려고 improve myself. 여러분 improve 뒤에 나오는 것들이 많이 있는데 improve your English, improve, improve your my cooking skills. 요리 실력 또는 mm -hmm. improve my pronunciation 발음을 더 낮게 할 수도 있겠는데. Improve my reading abilities. 네. 그런데 그냥 그런 것들을 다 포함해서 자기 mm -hmm. 개발을 할 때에는 mm -hmm. The, improve myself. The ultimate goal, right? Yeah, to improve yourself in every, you know, aspect, in 네. everything, not just, you know, one or two things. 그렇죠. 스스로를 향상시키는 거죠. 또는 mm -hmm. 더 나은 사람이 되는 거죠. To take chances, mm -hmm. 도전을 하는 거고요. Take mm -hmm. a chance, 또는 mm -hmm. take chances. And to try new things, 새로운 mm -hmm. 것을 시도하려고 항상 노력을 한다고 합니다. Mm -hmm. Wow, maybe this is also her mom's influence? I think so as well. And maybe that's why Serena tries so many things. Remember, she, you know, that's she's right. a song artist. She did this camp before. Mm -hmm. She does many things. Yeah. <laughs> she has many, many talents. Yes. 그런데. And on the other hand, just as well. Mm -hmm. And on the other hand, just as well. 그리고 on the other hand라는 것은 보통 mm -hmm. 이, 이 표현만 쓰이기도 하지만 mm -hmm. 
좀 세트로 쓰이자면 mm-hmm. on this hand on one hand and the other, other hand, hand. Mm-hmm. 보통 두 가지 표현을 봤어요. on one hand and the, and other, the hand. other hand and 또또 또 하나 본 표현은 on the one hand. Oh, yeah. 더를 넣어서. on the one hand, on 네. the other hand or on this hand or on that hand you could even say. 아, this hand까지. Mm-hmm. 그러면 세 가지 표현이군요. Mm-hmm. 근데 그 앞에 내용을 빼고 그냥 on the other hand 반대로 mm-hmm. just as well 마찬가지로라고 mm-hmm. 말했고요. 어떤 내용인지는 그 다음 문장에 나오겠죠? Mm-hmm. But the next sentence first we have to take a look at the clip. It's important to never harm anyone. To um, never put obstacles in someone's way. It's important to never harm anyone. To um, never put obstacles in someone's way. s a r i n a 씨가 뭐라고 말했죠? <웃음> She said, "It's important to never harm anyone. To never put obstacles in someone's way." 음, 사실 그 문장이 빠른 건 아닌데 mm-hmm. never가 어떻게 잘못 들으면 조금 놓치기 쉬운 발음이었던 것 같아요. Mm-hmm. 왜냐하면 보통 빨리 말하면 never, ver가 좀 약해져요. Never, 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 지금 이제 남에게 피해주지 않는 이야기를 하니까 mm-hmm. 그래서 중간에 뭔가 연결할 수 있는 게 필요했던 거죠. Mm-hmm. She needed some kind of conjunction. Right. So she said, on the other hand, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. For sure. Okay, so the sentence one more time. Mm-hmm. It's important to never harm anyone, to never put obstacles in someone's way. 네, never harm anyone, 다른 사람을 절대로 해치지 않고 mm-hmm. maybe physically or Yeah, physically or emotionally. Probably in this case, emotionally, right? Mm. Because in the next sentence, she says to put obstacles in someone's way. 네. And that's a form of harm. 그렇죠. 여기 이제 오늘의 핵심 문장이 들어가 있는데 다른 사람이 가는 길에 장애물을 놓지 않는 것도 중요하다라는 말입니다. Mm-hmm. So, for example, you are competing with this person mm-hmm. and so that you can win. Win, right? Let's say there's a one position open and there are two people. So maybe you do something to make this person look bad. That's right. Or something. Or, you know, take something away from them and don't give them all the information. Mm. Yeah. 다른 사람을 약간 폄하하거나 다른 사람을 뭐 방해하려고 yeah. 방해 공작을 펼치거나 이런 mm. 것들을 해서는 안 된다. 그냥 정정당당하게 yeah. 경쟁을 해야 된다는 이야기죠. Mm-hmm. Fair competition is the key here. Yeah. All right, let's hear this part two more times. It's important to never harm anyone. To Um, never put obstacles in someone's way. It's important to never harm anyone. To um, never put obstacles in someone's way. Okay, so let's see what other advice she has for us. And if you try something and you fail, then I just think it's not destined to be. And if you try something and you fail, then I just think it's not destined to be. 네, 재미있는 표현 두 가지 나오고 있습니다. And if you try something, 여러분이 무언가를 시도하는데 And you fail, if에 다 포함된 내용이죠. Mm-hmm. If A, A and, and B. B. If you do A and you do B, mm-hmm. 이렇게 A와 B를 했는데 mm-hmm. 아니면 아, 네, A와 D를, B를 하면 mm-hmm. 그 다음에 나오는 내용이 C가 되는 거죠. If A and B, then, then C. C. 정리가 됐나요? And if you try something, 시도를 했는데 And you fail. 재미있는 표현이라고 했던 건첫 번째는 fail이에요. fail은 <웃음> 실패하다라는 뜻으로 조금 무거운 뜻인데 <웃음> 실제로 친구들끼리 이야기할 때에는 <웃음> 장난으로 yeah. 좀 농담으로 많이 하죠. Yeah. We use fail a lot. So even something simple like if h e n u s i m has coffee and he tries to drink it but he just misses his mouth <웃음> and a little bit of coffee falls. 음, 그러면 I can 옆에서 say fail. fail 이렇게 말을 하고요. <웃음> 또는 온라인으로도 많이 뭐쓸 수도 있겠고 <웃음> 그리고 스스로에 대해서 스스로 했던 실수에 대해서 mm-hmm. 자기 자신을 약간 놀리는 그런 mm-hmm. 농담 코드가 영어권에서는 흔하잖아요. 그래서 <웃음> yeah. 자기가 실수했던 걸 올리면서 today's fail. Yeah. 네. And there are even like fail vlogs where people just post everything that they did wrong or like funny stories That's about right. things that happened. Videos of Yeah, videos as yeah. well. fail Well, fail footage, I guess. Fail compilation 네, footage. 네. 그런 경우가 굉장히 <웃음> 많습니다. 그래서 fail 하면은 딱 그냥 어떤 단어만 봤을 때는 실패 실패하면 좀 무겁잖아요. It's yeah. a very heavy word. It's very heavy, but for us, fail is very... It can be used in a very light way. So if you say, oh, today I failed, usually I'm thinking, oh, she probably you know, made a mistake 아. in her class or something, but nothing really big. 맞아요, 맞아요. Yeah. 
진짜로 today I failed 이 문장을 실제로 썼다면 <웃음> 어, 뭐 그냥 사소한 실수 같은 거 있을 수 있어요. Yeah. 뭐 열심히 아까 만, 말씀하신 것처럼 차 이야기를 하자면 열심히 만들어 놓은 차를 아무 생각 없이 설거지를 해버렸다든지 <웃음> 이런 것들이 today I failed로 어, 표현이 되는데 <웃음> 우리말로 번역하면 오늘 난 실패했어. In your job interview, in your test, on your yeah. test, or something major in your life? Yeah. 그런 건 아닌 거죠. Right. 그 다음에 이제 넘어가는 것이 Then I just think it's not destined, destined to, to be. be. 원래 destined to be의 이 형태보다 더 익숙하신 단어는 destiny일 거예요. Oh, right. 네. It kind of sounds like destiny. Destined to be. Destiny, 네. maybe. 운명이란 뜻인데 mm-hmm. To be destined to, to 하면 은 yeah. 뭐뭐를 할 운명인 거죠. Right. It means that that thing is your destiny. You, your destiny is something you are destined to be. That's right. <웃음> Megan, let me say something really okay. cheesy. We're destined to work together. I think we are destined to work together. We make a great team. Yeah, that was really cheesy. 다음 문장으로 넘어가 보겠습니다. <웃음> it's okay. And if you have made a mistake, then, well, it's okay. And if you had made a mistake, then, well, 그렇죠. Mm. 네, 아직 문장이 끝나지 않았기 때문에 mm-hmm. well, yeah, it's 근데, like, well. <웃음> 괜찮아요 한 다음에 it's okay, 괜찮아요. And if you have made, made a mistake, mistake 실수를 이제 안할 수도 있겠지만 혹시라도 하게 되면 이라고 강조하려고 if you have를 강조하게 됩니다. Mm-hmm. Have made a mistake, mm-hmm. then well. 네, 이런 말이고요. 그 다음. Mm-hmm. You can learn from this mistake and improve yourself and either try again or you can learn from this mistake and improve yourself and either try again or 네. 그 실수를 통해서 배우게 되고요. Improve yourself, mm-hmm. 향상, 스스로를 향상시켜서 either try again, 다시 시도를 하거나 mm-hmm. 어렵지 않은 내용들입니다. Mm-hmm. 그리고 이제 마지막 문장이 남아있는데요. 클립 먼저 보시죠. If it was something bad, don't do it ever again. If it was something bad, don't do it ever again. Okay. What did she say? I won't do it ever again. She said... If it was something bad, don't do it ever again. 네. If it was something bad, 만약 안 좋은 실수였다면 Don't do it ever again. 이 부분이 좀 빨랐어요. Mm-hmm. Don't, don't do it ever again. Don't do it ever again. Don't do it ever again. 다시 안 하면 되죠. 라는 문장까지 공부를 해보겠습니다. 이 부분 다시 한번 들어보시죠. If it was something bad, don't do it ever again. If it was something bad, don't do it ever again. All right, and that was the final sentence. So we're going to take a look at the entire clip two more times. The first time with English subtitles and the second time without. Let's watch. Today I should be talking about things that I regret doing or not doing. But to be honest, and I'm really honest, I don't have any regrets at all. Um, I'm thankful to my mother that she told me to... live my life in such a way that I can come home every day, look into the mirror and tell myself, hey, today I'm proud of you. You tried your best and there's nothing to regret. Um, I always try to improve myself, to take chances, to try new things. And on the other hand, just as well, it's important to never harm anyone, to... Um, never put obstacles in someone's way. And if you try something and you failed, then I just think it's not destined to be. It's okay. And if you have made a mistake, then, well, you can learn from this mistake and improve yourself and uh, either try again or if if it was something bad, don't do it ever again. (laughs) Today I should be talking about things that I regret doing or not doing. But to be honest, and I'm really honest, I don't have any regrets at all. Um, I'm thankful to my mother that she told me to live my life in such a way that I can come home every day, look into the mirror and tell myself, Hey, today I'm proud of you. You tried your best. And there's nothing to regret. Um, I always try to improve myself, to take chances, to try new things. And on the other hand, just as well, it's important to never harm anyone, to um, never put obstacles in someone's way. And if you try something and you failed, then I just think it's not destined to be. It's okay. 
And if you have made a mistake, then, well, you can learn from this mistake and improve yourself and uh, either try again or if it, was, if it was something bad, don't do it ever again. <laughs> 사리나 씨 감사합니다. 이번엔 또 재미있는 표현들 몇 가지 더 배워볼까요? Okay, it's time for street smart. smart.